Hey folks, how's it going? Today, I'm here to tell you about the story of St. Patrick's Day. So, uh, basically, uh, there was this guy and his name was Patrick. And then somebody came along and was like, Hey, you look pretty faintly. I'm gonna kidnap you and take you to Ireland. And he was like, yeah, okay, I hear there's, like, uh, booze there or something. So, he, uh, he went to Ireland, and, uh, he was like, man, oh man, this is the place. I'm, st I'm gonna stay, and I'm gonna just go ahead, and I'm gonna be the, the patron pope of Ireland. And they were like, thanks, Patrick, but, uh, the deal is, is, is we got, um, all of these, uh, snakes. We got all these snakes, and we need you to take care of them. So, he was like, yeah, okay, what do you want me to do? And they were like, you need to beat off the snakes. And he took it literally. So he went around, and he was getting some some hot snake action. He was just drunk. He was messy drunk. And he was, uh, he was like, hey, snake, I'm gonna beat you off. And the snake was like, sounds good. And the guy I he was like, ah! And he, he managed to whack off every single snake in Ireland. And he was like, all right, you guys happy? They were like, yeah, we're pretty satisfied. So uh, they went ahead and they left Ireland. And uh, that is the meaning of Christmas. I'm uh, St. Patrick's Day. And uh, these days, mostly instead of beating off snakes and making sweet love to shamrocks, uh, most, uh, people celebrating St. Patrick's Day these days mainly just drink all the booze they can and try to forget about the pain of their father's belt while they do it. So, you know, um, happy St. Patrick's Day. Uh, hopefully you can drink to forget. Um, and it's the day when everyone is Irish. So, run out there, beat off a snake, drink a bottle... And, uh, yeah, happy St. Patrick Fitzgerald, Gerald Fitzpatrick Day.